Good morning, Grand Middle School. Today is Wednesday, May 15th. It is a 1.30 dismissal. I'm your host, Soraya, and this is my co-host, Kamora. Today is an odd day. What's on the menu today? Manager's choice. At breakfast, you must put all your things down before going through the line. This means your Chromebook bags, purses, and coats. Please clean up after yourselves after breakfast and lunch. Treat yourselves, others, and the building with respect. Absolutely no food can leave the lunchroom. None. This means no open bags of chips, no closed bags of chips, no drinks. If an adult sees you with the food, you will be told to throw it away. Also, remember, no food is allowed in classrooms. Student, this is an expectation in all classrooms. When an adult asks you to give them the food or put it away, you are expected to follow their request. The first time the direction the first time the directions is given. Dress code is still in effect. Jackets and coats are still not allowed in classrooms. Be sure to take your hoods down when entering the building. Finally, purses are not allowed in class. You need to put them away into lockers. This, in this includes purses. Boys, girls, anyone, no one is allowed to have a purse. Clear? Not clear? It does not matter. AP teachers, please pause now and make sure these expectations are being followed. Students, you need a green or laminated nurse pass in order to see the nurse. You cannot just go on your own. You cannot be in the hallway without a pass. You also cannot be in the halls in the first 10 minutes or the last 5 minutes of class. So you might as well just stop asking. Remember, once you are in, you're in. So, no getting going into class and then back out. This includes leaving your stuff in classrooms. You are in middle school. Please use your lockers. All these expectations are clearly posted on the house rules in all of your classrooms. Now to Javon's with sports. Thank you, guys. We have learned that due to a mishap at the sectionals meet, our grand A grade boys and our grand A grade girls four by one relays teams will complete will compete at at the state meet along with those who who wasn't okay along with those we announced yesterday. For any eight graders interested in playing football at Springfield High, there will be an incoming freshman player slash parent meeting on Monday, May twentieth at May twentieth at six forty five p.m. in the H S S H S Commons. <laughs> Please email Coach Heb with any questions. Now back to our host. Thank you, Javonis. Administrative lunch detectives listed are posted in three spots around the school on the building support outside of room 112, outside of room 227, and between room 215 and 217. You, the student, needs to check the, that list. Detention names are no longer read before lunch shifts. After school, lunch detentions are Tuesdays and Thursdays after school from 2.30 to 4. Please note, if you are sent out by a substitute, it will automatically be two after school detentions. This does not include permanent substitute teachers. If you are removed from lunch detention, it will result in an automatic after school detention. Just like lunch detentions, these will be listed on the information boards around the building. The Purple Positive store will be open every Friday during all three lunch shifts. Remember, Learning Lab is offered from 2.45 to 4, Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. Find the link on one of your teacher's Canvas's pages. Be sure to fill it out. Fill out. Be sure to fill out the form before the last lunch shift. Meet in the all-purpose room if you do stay. Remember to respect of others' properties to and from school. The expectation that grant is to keep your hands and feet to yourselves at all times during the school day and on your way to and home from school. For your safety, students should only cross at the designated crosswalk areas Chatham Road, Stage, and Amos. Now please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance by Mr. Burkett's advisory class. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. all right. Today's joke comes from Jeffrey Washington. What did 50 Cent do when he got hungry? God, I don't want to know what. 58. <laughs> that was actually bad, Jeff. If you have a joke you want to share, email it to Ms. Buckles or write it down on a piece of paper and place it in the box outside of 203.
Our idiom today is mend your ways. If you mend your ways, you improve your behavior and stop doing things that cause trouble. This realized how much she had upset her teacher and decided that she would mend her ways the rest of the school year. Our vocabulary word is captivate. Captivate means to attract and, att oh my God. Captivate means to attract intensely and fixably. The teacher was captivated by their acting ability. Do we have any birthdays? Yes, Harmony Crescent eighth grade and Job Person Baxton and Tremiana Short in six. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday! Remember to take your Chromebook home and get a charge.